Today, I'm taking my girlfriend into the Everglades to see if she can catch her first snake. But before we can leave, Michaela has some training to do. No, 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 not that type of training. Come here. We have some training to do inside. For this training course, we'll be pulling out one of our pet snakes that's very similar to what Michaela will be catching. Maverick is trying to sneak in. Maverick, you are not a part of this training course. All right, here he is. Now, Michaela, all you have to do is grab the snake behind the head so he can't turn around to bite you. Michaela is going in for the grab. She's got him. Look at that. I think Michaela is ready to catch her first snake. So Michaela and I are in the truck now and we're almost in the area to start looking for snakes But Michaela is expressing to me on this drive that she's still a little bit nervous. Michaela, tell us how you're feeling Honestly, I'm scared. I'm not prepared because the snakes at home are a little smaller And I feel like we're gonna have to catch a giant snake and I'm gonna get bit Well, I don't know what's gonna happen if it ends up being the 20 foot python that we could find out there. I mean, that's really the goal here is to find the biggest possible python and remove it from the Everglades because there's such a big problem down here. But if it ends up being a snake over 10 feet, 15 no feet, way. maybe I'll have to jump in and help. We're just gonna have to see what happens. Let's see when we get there. Look at that. Look how pretty that is. And I'm not talking about Michaela right now, although Michaela is beautiful, but we are looking out there. Look at that gorgeous view. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. You are beautiful. We, we give Michaela a lot of credit, but right now we're in the Everglades and every time I come out here, I'm just stunned, especially at this time. It is sunset and this is when all of the wildlife likes to come out. There's birds and otters and different things active during the day, but the snakes love to come out here at night. Oh my gosh, there's something right there. Get out, get out, get out. What is this? Michaela, come catch your first snake. Oh my goodness, we have already realized as we were stopping the car that this guy is not going too far. This is really sad to see, but on this road, this snake has become a casualty to a truck and this is one of the pythons that we are after. Michaela. I don't think Michaela's touching this nasty thing. I think we need to get back into the truck because if the snakes are moving, then we have to keep looking. I don't believe that. Oh, I almost fell. We found what we were looking for. It is the first one of the night. Look at this. I don't think this guy's going anywhere. Oh, he notices we're here. He notices we're here. This is just a small python and it is the perfect one. Oh my goodness. He's coming for Michaela. Did he strike at you? He just started going that way. He has just come out of the swamp here and is starting to make his way towards the road over there. Michaela, I think you're gonna have to catch this one. I think you're gonna have to get him. Woohoo! This is absolutely crazy, guys. All right, Michaela, do you think you're able to grab him? <laughs> grab him by the tail. I'm scared. She's too scared. It's okay. He's just moving along. I really don't think I can do this. <laughs> I really don't think I can. We thought that we trained Michaela appropriately, but Michaela, I think we're gonna have to do it together. He's going under the cart. I've gotta pull him out. What a beautiful snake. I think we're gonna have to do a teamwork on this one. All right, I got him behind the head. Michaela, you grab him right behind my hand. All right, he's got his mouth open. He's ready to strike. He's trying to get Michaela on the hand there. Woo! Michaela has caught her first snake. Look at that. Me! <laughs> <laughs> he just pooped all over Michaela. I don't know if we got that on camera. Look at that, her first snake. So I just sent a picture to my good buddy Jacob because these snakes have started moving out here and he wants to come over here. So I think we're gonna join him. Look at this thing. 
So I had to call Jacob to link up with us. What is going What's on, up, dude? Bro? He's actually out here in the Everglades looking for snakes and putting this cyber truck to the paces. I don't know if you guys can really see it here. We're gonna have to get some better shots of it later, but Michaela and I have figured we would team up with Jacob and try to look for snakes. Jacob, have you ever taken this thing out to the Everglades? So this is the first time I've taken it out to the Everglades. I think this is the only cyber truck that's been to the Everglades. And I think this is the first cyber truck to go python hunting too. I don't even know how many cyber trucks are out there right now, just on the regular streets, but definitely this levee that we're standing on has never seen a cyber truck before, but I'm hoping we can get a python in this thing tonight. We've already got one snake. We know they're out here moving. Let's hop in the truck. Look who our driver is. Oh my goodness. We have the best designated driver here. Michaela already caught her python. So now it is time to see if Jacob or myself can catch a snake. It has been a little while since Jacob and I have filmed together, but we have a lot of different things on each other's channel. So guys, definitely make sure to go check out Jacob's channel because there are a lot of crazy animal activities we've gotten into together. But right now what we're doing, Jacob has a spotlight while I'm oh, yeah. taking some clips. We're trying to scan the side of this levee with the bright spotlights. We're looking for snakes as they're coming up out of the vast Everglades onto this levee. They come to this area to hunt food, specifically here at night, and right now is the perfect time. We've spotted an alligator. We're gonna see if we can sneak up on it. Oh, there he is. Dude, it's a little guy. What is it? A water snake, a water snake. Really? Right here, yeah. We're off to a great start. Let's Hold on, maybe we have to go by foot. Maybe we have to hop out of the truck. I think we're gonna bring this little guy over to Michaela. Hold on a second. Hold on, don't, you don't have to strike me now. We don't need you to do that. Michaela, you're gonna wanna see this. <laughs> that is snake number two. Oh, he's taking off. This is just awesome to see. First an alligator and now this. I don't know if we really caught the alligator on the camera. Oh. I don't know what this water snake wants to do right now. He was probably hunting for some small frogs and some uh, fish over there by the edge of that canal. And we're just gonna let him go here, but it's really nice to be able to find the native snakes because sometimes on different nights, it's actually more rare to find a native snake than these invasive pythons like we caught earlier. So we are gonna let this guy back on his way, hopefully, he'll be able to find some dinner. Look at this. So Jacob just spotted this baby alligator crossing the road. I think this is the one that we saw just before finding the water snake. Look how cool this is. That was an amazing night. It's actually now the next morning and as I'm going through this footage, I'm realizing that we weren't able to get the last few clips correctly on this camera. Jacob has the shots of a big python that we ended the night with. So if you guys want to see a bigger snake, you have to go over to Jacob's channel. This is a photo of it right here. Michaela and him kind of caught it together. And I'm so happy you guys were able to join us as we caught our first snake as Michaela caught her first python in the Everglades. If you guys want to see more of that, subscribe to the channel below and I will see you guys, maybe with Michaela, in the next adventure. Peace.